Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Um, so today it will be apparent from the title of course but you can also tell from what I have laid out in front of me. Um, we are going to be setting up for Billy's fifth comeback. Is that correct? Fifth comeback slash fourth mini album. Pretty crazy. That feels insane to be honest considering they did not debut that long ago, but um, slay for us, not slay for my wallet, as as the story goes. Um, so today we are going to be setting up for their comeback to the Village of Perception chapter three. Um, yeah, I put the amount of pages we need in my binder already, but um, I want to go over the inclusions with you all before we get into that um, so we know what's going on. Um, and yeah, I'm... A little bit worried because you might not be able to tell from this angle but my binder is very full um i would like to be able to fit this comeback into this binder but <laughs> if um we run into space issues and i need to get a third billy photo card binder um i'm going to hate my life um also like i'm debating switching out of these binders and just moving them into a normal three ring because they really don't afford a lot of space but I really like the way they look <laughs> and it would be like really suck to not have any use for all those supplies after I spent I mean I didn't spend that much money on it it was pretty cheap but you know like still I still spent money on it so it feels wasteful um but it also feels wasteful to keep getting more and more and more of these binders so I'm not really sure what to do about that um that is yet to be seen, to be honest, but not important right now, I guess. <laughs> What's important is setting up for the comeback. So, as you can see here, there are three photo book versions, the 1.01 a.m. collection, the 11.11 a.m. collection, and the 11.11 p.m. collection. Um, these are the normal size of all their photo books. They look a little bit wider for some reason, but they're not. They're the same size, I believe. And it looks like we're also getting a slipcover this time, which is kind of fun. I presume it's a slipcover. I don't like understand why there would be this border there otherwise, but it's hard to tell. That's just my guess. And so we have the CD, of course, lyric poster, drawing paper, and then we get into the photo cards. So this is pretty much the same as their previous album releases. Um, there are two sets for each album version and you get two out of 14 cards um, so you'll get one from each set normally. The interesting thing about the details this time is that it looks like the two sets are not going to be similar in any way. Um, for reference for the Collective Soul and Unconscious chapter one, the first set from each album was the same concept and the second set was different and then for uh, Village of Perception chapter two the album sets both were the same concept um, for each version, if that makes sense. But it looks this time like we're getting six different sets, which is really interesting. It's it's hard to tell, of course, like these three could all look, you know, they could look kind of similar, but my guess is that they're different, um, which is really nice because I would really appreciate it if we got some more PC variety. Um, as far as their past comebacks have gone, I don't love how many similar looking sets we've gotten just because when you're collecting everything, it's nice to have more variety, honestly. <laughs> so uh, this is an exciting development. And then we have the Cursed Evil Polaroid photos, as we always do. You get one out of 30. It's a crime against humanity, or me specifically. Um, but there will be four sets and then two groups if it follows how it's been for every other comeback. And then this time, instead of the IDs we got in the Collective Soul and Unconscious Chapter 1 and the postcards we got in the Village of Perception Chapter 2, we have a extra set of photo cards um, called Doppelganger cards, I think because they're double-sided. Um, and yeah, so that's kind of nice. I do like larger inclusions, to be honest. I don't like IDs, not a huge fan of those, but for larger inclusions like postcards, I'm a fan, um, but I'm okay with an extra card set, of course. Stickers, posters, you know the drill. Um, Oh, that's funny. This page has <laughs> a like, mistake at the bottom. Um, there is no special photo card this time as far as we can tell, so that's nice. And I did pre-order seven copies from Makestar from their um, signed album and pre-order benefit event. So not the first fan sign, but that one. Um, just because I don't really like <laughs> entering fan signs, even though obviously I'm not going to win 
the seven albums or it's very unlikely that I will I still don't really like to put my name in like that stresses me out so <laughs> I prefer doing like other kinds of pre-order events so that was the one I chose we don't have a preview for what those cards look like but they do have a pink back so I don't know they might be in the 11 a.m collection concept but then it looked like the regular like fan sign pre-order was in this concept so I'm not really sure but I assume they'll be in one of the album concepts I don't know we shall see I guess when they arrive to me um but yeah so I will have unboxing albums for this era which I'm really happy about because I did not have like a proper unboxing last era um I did unbox a lot of albums on my channel but I didn't do like a normal like unboxing Billy's The Village of Perception chapter two, you know? So yeah, I'm really glad that <laughs> I was able to do that this time. I was really only able to order unboxing albums because Promises Come Back got mysteriously delayed. Um, and otherwise I would have probably um, like resisted ordering so many, but since I don't really know when Promises happening, certainly not <laughs> within the next month anyway, I figured it was a fine decision. So yeah, um, but basically let's get into it. We will just be signing up for the inclusions in my photo card binder. Um, currently there aren't really, like I might store the stickers and the drawing papers, but I don't have my larger inclusion binder with me. It's at home um, and I don't really see the need to set up for that stuff. So yeah, um, this is not going to be a very exciting setup video because I do not make individual like fillers for each member because to me that's a waste of paper <laughs> like if you want to do that I think it looks really cute but I don't know I just like they're gonna get filled up anyway and I know the member order so I don't see the point in doing that but yeah let's get started by um filling out my sticky notes I guess so first up we are going to have the 0101 am set one Um, okay, we have the fillers for the album cards done. Now we need to do the polos. All right, so here are our fillers. Um, I'm a little bit worried about the amount of white sleeves I have. Uh, let's hope I can fill all the corners. <laughs> if not, I'm going to have to change all these to um, extra sleeves I have, which is going to piss me off. So let's hope I don't have to do that. <laughs> okay, so here we are in the Billy Binder. I am so close to finishing the last era. I've actually made a lot of progress since my last video where I talked about um everything so yeah I still am not convinced I will finish before the comeback but um I'm getting there for sure so that is nice okay so first things first I need to take out these is there a blue one hanging somewhere in here no. So first things first, we need to fill in the corners for this comeback. Um, yeah. <laughs> I am so excited for this comeback, by the way. Um, the teaser photos so far have all been absolutely stunning. I think my personal favorite concept has been the, um, the one they did where they looked like literally like models in like a hair product commercial or something like those photos were so beautiful um it was a very simple concept but if a simple concept has really nice photography like <laughs> I'm all for it um I do prefer like brighter cuter concepts but since we've gotten like literally three different schoolgirl concepts this come back I'm happy to have something that's a little bit different I don't know what it is about mystic and schoolgirl concepts but like what are they gonna do when <laughs> 
the youngest members aren't even like high school age anymore because they're getting close to that point. Like, are we still gonna be doing schoolgirl concepts? I really hope not. <laughs> I hope they can come up with something else after that point, but we'll see, I guess. Um, so yeah, but the model pictures have definitely been my favorite. And then um, the past two days we've gotten track drops. Today we got Lionheart and the day before that we got Nevertheless. Those songs sound literally amazing. Um, I, <laughs> I mean, obviously we have to wait to hear the full songs and hear, you know, the whole comeback, but who knows? We might be preparing for like Billy's best album. You never know. Their B-sides continue to really impress me every comeback. <laughs> um, and I think that this one will be no exception. I would expect nothing less less from my girls. Um, but yeah, the songs have sounded beautiful so far. And um, right now the girls are in Texas. I think still they might have left already, but they've been posting a lot of pictures from when they were in Texas, um, which is really cute. I, you know, am a student. I can't just fly all over the country for these things, but I really hope that I can see them someday in person because I love them so much. So let me make sure I did this correctly. You know, with me, I am prone to small mistakes like this, so. Okay, that's good. Perfect. So, here are my fillers, um, and I am going to put the doppelganger cards first, because um, with the IDs for the Collective Soul and Unconscious, I put those first, um, and I think it's the, like, most logical place for them, because it won't break up, like, the other album sets, so we're just going to do that. Thankfully, I had the exact correct amount of white sleeves, um, so yeah, I don't even know when I last bought a box of white sleeves, like, I really stretch <laughs> these boxes to the limit, um, reusing them as much as I can, uh, because I hate buying sleeves. I don't know why, but to me, it's just like the most irritating thing about collecting is buying supplies. <laughs> like buying new binders and stuff is cute, but buying pages and fillers, no. There's nothing I want to do less. <laughs> so I'm glad that I've been able to stretch this one box of sleeves so thin, uh, but I fear that the end is coming soon. <laughs> um, and let's hope that this comeback does not take me like eight months to complete this time. Um, if I can get my ass in check. Uh, Oh, shit. I am one sleeve off. I forgot to make a filler for the Make Star cards. We will use this sad little mint sleeve. Also, Dragon Shield, does this look like mint to you? I don't think so. That is not mint. You know what's mint? Yeah. That is the color mint. Look at this. What is this? It's that. Anyway, <laughs> I forgot to make a filler for my Make Star pods. I was like, I totally... <laughs> made the right amount of pages, so what did I do? But I was in the right. Okay. I just have the memory of a goldfish, apparently. But that's fine. <laughs> okay. It doesn't really matter since this page will obviously be filled up immediately. I'm going to get the full set. <laughs> Unless Make Star somehow screws me over. Uh, knock on wood, I don't think that'll happen though. So here is the setup for the Village of Perception Chapter 3. The doppelganger cards, 1.01 a.m., 11 a.m., 11, 11 a.m., <laughs> 11, 11 p.m., and then the Polaroids, everybody's worst nightmare, <laughs> and then the Mixer Pops. So yeah, that is what this comeback is looking like. As you can see, my binder is very full. Um, let's just hope that we can survive this era <laughs> before getting a new binder, because I don't want to. I really don't want to. I don't want to do that. I want at least to fit three arrows in here. So let's hope for the best. <laughs> but yeah, that was everything for today. I really hope you enjoyed. I hope you are excited for Billy's comeback as I am. Um, and yeah, I hope that I will see you again soon. So bye bye. Beggar. Oh, my God.
한다, 한다, 안 한다, 한다. 일로 와봐, 사랑해. 